Hello everyone. Good evening po sa inyong lahat. Good evening everyone. Okay, paki-share na wan diyan sa sa link char sa mga TLE major diyan. Okay, so magde-drills po tayo today. So we will we will have drills. So pag sinabing drills, yes. guys, um Good evening. like drills lang. <laughs> Okay, walang questions. We will just um, have our drills. Okay, so itong mga drills po namin ay kinuha po namin or I mean, hindi kinuha. Like, nag-talk po kami sa mga TLA majors po sa lumabas po sa mga previous exams. And ito po ang um, aming itatat- itatalakay ngayon, Char. <laughs> Ita-ita-ta. Yes, tama. Ita-ta-ta. Sorry po. Okay, so handa na ba dyan? Sino ba dito yung TLA uh, majors dyan? Sino ang mga so, TLA majors nga kayo. dito? Oh, watching from Bohol. Hello po, Ma'am Jeremy Wagas. So we have 41 viewers na today. So actually, wala po si Teacher V ngayon. Yes. Because he yes, has baby. an important matter to attend, Char. Okay, so comment, comment naman dyan. Hello, everyone. Hello, John Vincent Isolana. Oh. Yes, tinay nga natin yung mga... Hello, ano. Sir John. Okay. So, comment, comment. So, bago tayo magsimula, kumusta po ang lahat? Ready na po ba kayo sa September exam? So, are you a September taker, guys? Or sa next year pa? <laughs> okay. So, sa mga... Yes. So, I think mga, they're all ready. Ready na sila. So, sa mga next year taker, 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 taker po, okay, um, make sure um, to study about history, about social sciences ng mga subjects. Kasi nag-attend po kami ng seminar actually. And then, marami daw or, or malaki daw ang percentage po sa mga social sciences ng mga subjects. For example, like Jose Rizal, ganyan po. And then history, history of the Philippines, ganyan po. Alright. So, laban lang. Hello, 61 viewers. Wow, ang dali naman. Hello po, laban lang. Shout Hello. out. Hello, ay, ang dami nila. <laughs> okay, watching. Watching from Cherry Miwa. Uh, Cherry Miwagas. Watching. Take your September, take your siya. Nice guy, makabright o gapin. <laughs> Char, sana all. Okay, huwag kayong kabahan, guys. Ay, okay lang kabahan kasi normal lang. Normal lang yan. Yes. Normal lang kabahan. Okay. Alright. Yan. Yeah. Alright. So, ilan na ba tayo, Teacher Echo? We have 64 Five. viewers now. Okay. Share daw brain cells, Teacher Nikki. <laughs> oh, share mo na, Teacher Echo, yung brain cells mo. Kasi tapos na natin ginamit, di ba? Igay mo naman. Wow, wag naman. Kasi gagamitin pa. <laughs> gagamitin mo pa. Okay. Actually, yes, the Ali po ay madami pong dapat studyhan kasi maraming mm, maraming aspect yung TLE like my uh, yes. masonry, my electricity, my iba't iba pa. So laban lang mga yeah. TLEs kaya believe ako sa mga top notchers sa top notchers sa TLE. May nagtap ng TLE last sa kabatch mo teacher Nikki sa secondary. Oh. Wow. Oh, talino. Grabe. Ang talino sa noon. Eh ayan. So ilan na ba tayo ngayon? So we are 72 now. Okay. Wala pa daw Hello, nag- everyone. Top, sir. Wala pa yung nag-top, sir. Mayroon na po sa CBRC. May nag-top na ti Alina. May nag-top mm-hmm. din na, na English. Oh, wow. Okay. Yes, yes. History if na-account naman. Wait. I will search the name if I'm not mistaken po. Sige, Wait, sige. Check, check mo ano, teacher echo. Baka ano. 
Baka... Okay, so uh, habang nagsisearch pa si Teacher Echo, yan, so chat naman po kayo, mga lang, katreyo. Uh, ilang percent na ba kayo ready, no? Ngayong September, yan. 100% na ba? Dapat 100% na talaga. Okay. Yes. Okay, so... Meron na top sa TLE daw, CBR yes, si Pusha. Siya. Yes, yes. May nagtap sa TLE and his name po ay si Sir Ronald Cablas. Okay, seven spot po siya oh, sa left. congratulations. Okay. Seven spot po siya from Cavite State University po. Okay, Cavite State University who top the secondary level. Okay, TLE. Mm-mm. Laban na. Ayun. Sana all mag-top sa telly, di ba? Okay. So, sino bang telly major dyan? I-top nyo na rin, di ba? Huwag pa huli. Okay, search nyo. Um, Ronald Cablas. Para ma-inspire naman kayo. Yes. So, may nag-chat dito, 101% ready na daw. Bahalag cool ba? Okay. So, yes. bago tayo mag-start, bago tayo mag-wait sa mga TLA majors natin dito, marami, marami na tayo dito, 89. Wow, so puro TLE ba to? TLE takers ba ang nandito, nanonood? Kung 94 yeah. na tayo. Yeah, majors ba lahat? Hmm, TLE majors feel ko. Okay. Oh, ang ganda. So before we start guys, um kumusta na kayo? Are you ready for your exam? Nakabahan ba kayo? Ano mga questions na sa utak niyo? Para magbigay tayo ng motivation before tayo mag-start. Yes, bigyan mo na ah. sila ng motivation. Yeah. Okay, hello pot 93 viewer. So if you have a GC guys, um exclusive for TLE major Please send this link sa YouTube namin para mas ma-inform naman sila. Okay. Yes. Right. Um, so we have, I think, 96 viewers na, Teacher Echo. Yes, yes, wow. yes, yes. Wow. Hello po sa yung lahat. Thank you pala sa mga subscribers. Umabot na po tayo sa 6,000 subscribers po. Thank you po. Thank you so much, Bob. Yes, thank you. Yan, galing. Ganda. <laughs> Ibarami na tayong matutulungan. Okay? Okay, so before we start, at teacher Nikki, okay, let's take a picture muna para sa ating thumbnail for today's video. Okay, are okay, you ready? Okay, okay. Yeah. Okay, one, two, three, smile. Okay. All right. So, 100 na tayo today. Wow. Ah, 100 viewers. Hello po. Yes, yes, yes. Hello po sa inyong lahat. <laughs> okay, ayan. Okay, so, magsisimula so... na ba tayo, Teacher Echo? Yes, yes. Wow, we, have, we are 101 na. Okay, so magsisimula na tayo, guys. Ihanda na ang, okay, ihanda na ang sarili, ang ballpen at ang papel. All right, yes. so let's start, Teacher Nikki. So Teacher Nikki will start, okay, and I will be the next. All right, so let's yes. start, Ati Teacher Nikki. Ati Nikki, <laughs> okay, go. Okay, so before that, so magpapakilala muna ako sa hindi pa or sa bago pa dito sa aming channel. So by the way, I am Teacher Nikki, the top three, and... I am Teacher Echo, the top ten. Yeah. And we are the uh, oh, trio top notchers. Kita rin na natin si Teacher B. Okay. okay. Teacher B, the Tagging top Teacher four. V. <laughs> yes. Uh, teacher V, the top four. Yes. Okay. Let's start. Ooh, Ayan. All right. So, yes, we have 124 viewers right now. Uh, I think lahat sila tell a major at meron ding uh, nanunood. Thank you for supporting. So for now po, magdidrill po tayo. Tapos sagot-sagot lang po kayo dyan. Tapos itest niyo po, nyo, uh, nyo po yung sarili nyo kung kaya nyo po. Okay? Ayan. 
So, yes, magsisimula na po ako. Drills in Tele, kitang-kita nyo yan, okay? So, magsimula pa tayo sa uh, carpentry. So, ano ba yung carpentry, mga katreyo? That's art and manner of cutting, di ba? Forming and joining wood parts together. Pakitandaan, pag carpentry, art and manner of cutting, forming and joining wood parts together, okay? Ayan, so huwag kalimutan. Okay, and it involves shaping, assembling structural woodwork. Pakitandaan, okay, but ang laging tinatanong dito, ano yung carpentry, okay? Art of, art and manner of cutting, okay? Pakitandaan, mga katreyo, okay? So, paano naman yung person, okay? Yung taong gumagawa ng carpentry, ano yung tawag sa kanila? That's carpenter, di ba? Oh, di ba hindi na mahirap tandaan? No? Yung taong gumagawa ng carpentry, okay? O who performs carpentry works, o tinatawag nating carpenter, okay? How about naman yung skills? Ano yung tawag sa skills if we are developing in terms of measuring? Nagbe-measure ka, nagka-cut ka, you are framing, you are joining, and uh, you are also doing finishing wood materials. Anong tawag doon? Woodworking, okay? Pakitandaan, anong skills yon? Woodworking, Okay. Ayan. All right. So meron tayong um Okay, wait lang. Meron tayong um types of woods, okay? Ayan. So types of woods. Ano po yung types of woods mga katreyo? Okay? So sige nga. All right. So types of woods meron tayong lumber, lumber, yard lumber. Meron din tayong manufactured wood, di ba mga katreyo? Ano ba yung lumber? Ano bang laging tinatanong sa kanya sa board exam? Especially dito yung mga TLE major. O, syempre naman, di ba? TLE nga. Okay. So, lumber woods that came from trees. O, di ba? Ano ba yun? Either soft wood or hard wood. Okay? Pakitandaan, woods that came from trees, either soft wood or hard wood. Okay? So, ano bang tinatanong pag soft wood? Ano ba yun? Tinatawag siyang conifers, di ba? Oh, tama ba yung pagkakasabi ko, conifers? Because many of them uh, bear cones, di ba? Ganun yun mga katreyo. How about naman yung hard hardwood? Anong tinatanong sa kanya sa board exam? Okay? Comes from uh, comes from board leaf, okay? Or deciduous trees, di ba? Ganun yun, okay? Again, softwood called as conifers. Pag hardwood naman, uh, comes from board or broad leaf pala, broad leaf. Bakit board? Broad leaf. Ayun. Okay? Pangalawa nating type of woods naman is the yard lumber. Ano ba yung yard lumber? Ito ba yung maraming uses siya? Okay? Variety of uses. Ginagamitan siya sa uh, marami siyang purpose, yung ano, yung yard lumber. Okay? So, meron siyang ano, uh, select grade. Pag magsasalik ka ng grade dito, lumber of good appearance that can take different finishes such as stain, paint, and enamel. Okay? Yun na. May meron din tayong common grade sa yard lumber. So, yung common grade po, that is suitable for rough carpentry. Okay? Alright. It is suitable for rough carpentry. Pakitandaan, common grade. Okay? Under yan sa yard lumber, mga katreyo. Okay? So, meron din tayong type of wood, which is the manufactured wood, mga katreyo. Ano yan? Ano yung manufactured wood? Manufactured, ma-ma, man-made wood. Pakitandaan, manufactured wood, ma-ma, man-made wood. Okay? Ayan. So, huwag kalimutan. Okay? So, meron tayong mga types dito or kinds of manufactured wood. Ano dito yung, ang una dito yung wood veneer. Ano yung wood veneer? Ang tinatanong sa kanya, thin slices of wood. Pag tinanong kayo, thin slices of wood, that's wood veneer. Okay? Pag, meron, pag tinanong naman kayo ng sheet material from thin layers or plies of wood veneer, meron ng plies, okay, of wood veneer, that's plywood, mga katreyo, okay, plywood, alright, so meron din tayong press wood or fiber wood, ano ba yung press wood or fiber wood, mga katreyo, okay, it is also called as medium density fiber, mga katreyo, again, press wood or fiber wood, it is also called as medium density fiber, okay, ayan, or pakitandaan nyo lang, uh, MDF na lang, MDF, okay? Medium density fiber. That's pressed wood or fiber wood, okay? Kung meron tayong medium density fiber, mga katreyo, okay? Mga katel, major natin dyan. Meron din tayong low, di uh, low density fiber, mga katreyo. Ano yon? Ang tawag nun ay particle board. Mga katreyo, particle board, that's low density fiber, okay? Or Cheap board siya, cheap board, okay? It's cheaper, denser, and more uniform uh, kaysa sa mga ano, conventional wood or supply wood, okay? So, that's 
particle board. Okay? Low density fiber or LDF. Okay? Yan na lang. LDF. Okay? So, meron din tayo mga katreyo. Meron din tayong laminated wood. Ano ba yung laminated wood? So, these are processed by saw milling and drying. Okay? So, milling and drying. Okay? Ayan. Laminated wood. Pakitandaan mga katreyo. Okay? Ayan. So, i-drill natin. Babalikan natin to. Ayan. So, please, sagot-sagot po kayo dyan mga katreyo major natin. Okay? So, meron tayong defects of woods mga katreyo. Alright. So, yung first nating defect of wood, yung knot. Ano ba yung knot? Yung parang may hole dito sa wood, di ba? Branch or leaf has been exposed. Yung may wood dito. Tapos meron siyang parang may hole. Not ang tawag natin dyan, okay? So mga katreyo, ibang de uh, defect of wood naman, meron tayong check. Ano ba yung check? May small crack or split yung wood, okay? Pero pag, pag pinag-uusapan natin, big crack, ang tawag natin dyan, split. Okay? Pakitandaan mga katreyo, pag small crack lang, ang tawag natin, check. Oh, the spelling is C-H-E-C-K. Check, okay? Pag small crack lang or small na split. Pero pag big crack na in the board, tinatawag natin yung split, mga katreyo, okay? Alright. Pag naman yung, ano, yung defect naman sa wood, the rotting of the wood, tinatawag natin yung decay, oh, di ba? Pag nalalata yung isang bagay, decay naman talaga, di ba yung term, okay? So, decay, huwag malito, huwag ma-confuse, huwag mag-overthink. Okay, next naman tayo, meron tayong um, defect of wood na tinatawag nating stain. Ano ba yung stain? O discoloration of the wood. Again, discoloration of the wood, that's stain mga katreyo, okay? Ayan, pag ano ba yung sa Bisaya ba ito, uh, Teacher Echo, yung pag ka nang magpahak, o, pahak ang face sa wood, tinatawag natin yung wain. O, spelling natin yan, W-A-N-E. Mga katreyo, mga katel, i-major natin yan. Lock of wood on the face of the piece. Pag merong pahak siya, in Bisaya, o, that's wain. Okay? Ayan. Pero pag meron namang combination sa ano, may crack, may bow, may twist na, nangyaya, na nakikita natin sa wood, tinata tinatawag natin yung warp. Mga katreyo, warp. That's W-A-R-P. Warp. Okay? Ayan. So, again, balikan nga natin, deal natin. Okay. Pag merong hole, pag merong hole nakikita, the limb has been exposed, not yan. Pag small crack or small split, check yan. Okay. Pag big naman yung crack or big naman yung split, uh, big naman yung break na sa board, that's split. Okay. If there is the rotting of the board, okay, nalalata no yung wood, that's decay. Pag meron namang discoloration, that's stain, okay? Alright. Pag meron naman lack of wood on the face of the piece, okay, wain yan, okay, wain, pahak, pahak sa naong sa wood. Pero meron namang combination sa crack, bow, merong twist na nakikita natin sa wood, that's warp, okay? Alright. Next po tayo, mga katreyo, sagot-sagot lang po kayo, okay? So, meron po tayong Um, mga description na lumbers are sold on the following description, okay? So, ganun po yan. So, ano ba yung mga possible description if yung lumbers are sold? Okay, so, first natin, we have 2S2. Ano ba yung 2S2, mga katreyo? Okay? 2S2, that's surface, two sides. Meaning, it is plain or smooth on two sides, mga katreyo, okay? Again, S2S, that's surface, two sides, or plain or smooth on two sides. Pag meron, meron din tayong uh, S4S, mga katreyo, that's uh, surface, four sides. Meaning, plain or smooth on four sides, okay? Ayan. At meron din tayong S3S. Ano ba yan? So, ang S3S, it means plain or smooth on two sides. Then, one edge is ripped straight. Okay? Kaya S3S. Okay? okay. Uh, tandaan nyo na lang. Uh, kung uh, ano siya, two, uh, ano ba yun? Two S2 and then one edge is ripped straight. Okay? Yun na lang. S3S. Okay? Ayan. So, meron din tayong rough lumber. Ano ba yung rough lumber? That's uh, ano yan, um, yung ano niya, yung dimension niya is parang merong unplanned, okay? Or unplanned pala, unplanned. Rough lumber, okay? Unplanned siya. Alright? So, pag surface lumber naman mga katreyo, planed lumber usually less than in actual size. 
So by about 3 over 8 of an inch, okay, surface lumber, plain lumber, usually less than in actual size by about 3 over 8 of an inch. Okay, yan na lang po yung tandaan nyo mga katreyo, okay? Ayan, so pag tinanong yan, surface lumber agad mga katreyo, okay? Ayan, so tinatanong din po sa tell e major natin, um, prices of lumber ranges according sa, um, ano, Ano ba yun? Prices nila, nagkakaiba-iba yung uh, prices nila, okay? May range. So, first dito, tinitingnan nila yung ano, type of woods, okay? Yung type of woods, pag yung woods niya maganda, thin or rough, so nagkakaiba-iba yung presyo dyan sa lumber. Next naman yung dimensions, tinitingnan din yan sa dimensions, kaya nagkakaiba-iba yung presyo ng lumber natin. Next naman yung grades of lumber. Okay? So, may itong nagtatanong, wala po ba talaga ang PowerPoint? Wala po tayong PowerPoint kasi uh, drill lang po ito at pwede nyo pong balik-balikan kapag hindi nyo po nakuha yung ating uh, dinidiscuss ngayong gabi. Okay? Ayan. So, again, okay, ulitin ko. Okay, so, nasa prices na tayo ng lumber, di ba? So, meron tayong tinitingnan na mga ano, uh, ano ba to? Mga ranges, okay? According sa presyo ng lumber. First is type of woods. Next naman, dimensions. Next naman, grades of lumber. Okay? Grades of lumber. Ano ba yung grades of lumber? Either sun-dried, air-dried, or kiln-dried. Okay? Yung pagda-dry natin ng wood. Yung kiln-dried, di ba yung, yung artificial uh, way of drying the woods? Di ba? Yung kiln-dried. That's... K I L N, okay? That's artificial, okay? Artificial way of drying the woods, okay? Ayad. So, so next naman po tayo. Meron tayong um, basic consideration on the quality of work done. So, baka itanong to mga ka tell in natin jaan. So, first po is the quality of the wood selected, okay? So, of course, isa yan sa consideration, uh, consideration na ating titingnan if you are looking for the quality of the work done, di ba? Quality of the wood. Next naman yung the design of the project. Kailangan tingnan natin yan, okay? Design of the project. Next naman po yung ano, yung basic processes nito na involved in making the project, okay? Next naman yung wood preparation. Paano ba prepare yung wood, okay? So, isa rin yan sa titingnan natin na i-consider natin sa, the, sa quality of the work done sa wood. Next naman, seasoning. Ano ba yung seasoning? That's the process of drying the wood in preparation for uh, in using it, okay? So, uh, dumadanas muna or ano ba, may seasoning munang mangyayari, di ba, bago mo gamitin yung uh, wood, okay? Yung wood, okay? May seasoning muna, process. That's process of drying the wood, okay? And next naman dyan sa seasoning, finishing. Tinitingnan natin yung finishing, okay? Finishing of the wood materials, Okay? Alright. So, kuhang-kuha ba ng ating mga katreyo? Tinan natin, natin nilang yung mga chat nila. Yes, kuhang-kuha sila. Yes po, mas madali po kasi mag-aral pag may PowerPoint. Okay, pasensya na po. Ayan, so, yes, drill, drill lang po talaga kami. So, next time po, mag, uh, meron kaming ano, PowerPoint po. Okay, so, pasensya na po mga katreyo. Okay. Alright, so medyo busy rin po yung schedule namin but we are doing this for you, okay? Ayan. Alright, so uh, I think kuha-kuha na nila uh, Teacher V, uh, Teacher Echo and I think pwede nilang ulitin ang video pag uh, hindi na nila, hindi nila kuha itong ano na to. Like hindi nila completely nakuha yung drills ko, okay? So I will give the floor to Teacher Echo. Mag-drill ka ng John, Teacher Echo. All right. So hello everyone. So again, wala pong PowerPoint ito because it, it is uh, drills po. Okay, drills. So iba po yung magdi-discuss talaga kami ng content sa TLE. Okay, yun na yung may PowerPoint. Ito drills lang, okay? So it uh, you can always play this if mag sasakay kayo ng um jeepney ganyan. So you can always Listen to this, guys. Okay, walang notes, notes na. Lava na. All right. So, let's start with my topic. Okay. So, okay. Am I too fast, Char? Okay, so I will just um, make it... Um, kuan, hindi masyadong 
pas-pas. Okay. So, are you ready? Okay. So, let's start. Okay. So, guys, okay, nagtakol na si Teacher Nikki about the quality of work done. Okay. The basic consideration. Okay. So, ako, magtakol ako ng um, wood preparation. Okay. Wood preparation po. Okay, so my dalawang wood pre preparation, guys. We have seasoning, again, seasoning and finishing. Okay, seasoning or seasoning or finishing. Okay, so now, what is seasoning and finishing? So ano po, ano po yung seasoning, guys? Mm -hmm. Pag sinabi kong seasoning, guys, it is the process of, okay, drying the wood in preparation for you. So, dapat i-dry po yung wood natin before we will use it. Okay, that is seasoning. So, actually po, um, we have three process sa seasoning. Okay? We have three process sa seasoning. The first one po is treated. Okay, the first one to do is treated. What is treated, guys? Okay? Treated means use of chemical compound before seasoning. So, before ka mag-seasoning, dapat i-treated muna siya or i-treat muna siya. Okay? You will use chemical compounds. Alright? So, may dalawa tayong uri ng seasoning. We have air seasoning. Okay? Air. Air po. Air seasoning. And we have kiln seasoning. Okay? Kiln seasoning. K-I-L-N. Okay? Ano ang kaibahan ng air seasoning and kiln seasoning? Okay. Pag sinabing air seasoning, guys, ang other terms po niya is sun-dried. Again, ang other term po ng air seasoning is sun-dried. Okay? And then, kiln seasoning, other term is kiln dried. Okay? K-I-L-N dried. Okay? So, anong kaibahan ng air seasoning and kiln seasoning? Okay? Di ko mahabol sa pagsulat laban lang. <laughs> Okay, that's a challenge. Okay? Air seasoning, guys. Pag sabing air, okay, it is the feeling, it is feeling the wood in open air. Okay? Open air po. Dapat may air. Okay? That is air seasoning. Okay? Feeling the wood in, in open air. Okay? So, yan po yung mnemonics natin. Again, air seasoning, open air. Okay, very good. Marielle Birongay. All right. <laughs> So now, let's go to kill in seasoning. What is kill in seasoning? Okay. It is the use of oven. Okay. Oven to dry the wood. <laughs> okay. Oven po. Ginagamit po natin yung oven to dry the wood. Okay. Late po si Ruena Sarabosing. Laban lang. Okay. Kill in. Use of oven to dry the wood. All right. So, meron po tayong uh, approximate moisture po. Um, of drying the wood, guys, for our home furniture. Okay. May dalawa po, may soft wood tayo and may hard wood. So, ilang percent po? Approximately. Okay. Ilang percent? Pag sinabi kong soft wood, 20% lang. 20% to zero for soft wood and 6 to 12% for hard wood. Again, so approximately moist. Approximate moisture content, guys, of drying hardwood for home furniture are, number one, 20% for softwood and 6 to 12% for hardwood. Okay? All right. Now, let's go to finishing. Tapos na tayo sa seasoning. Let's go to finishing. Okay? So, may iba't ibang mga finishing po na gagamitin. We have the first one is varnish. Okay, what is varnish? Okay. So ang varnish po kilala, kilala na natin 'yan kasi ginagamit na natin 'yan sa bahay. Okay? So varnish po most use clear finishing material. Okay? Ang ating mnemonics diyan is use clear. Okay? Clear finishing material. Okay? Varnish use clear finishing material. Okay? That's it. All right. Now, we have Scraper. Ano yung scraper, guys? Oh, mag-scrape mag ka. Okay? Ang scraper po ay mag-produce po siya, mag siya ng very smooth surface. Okay? So, meaning, 
ma meron siyang magawa or meron siyang ma-produce na very smooth na surface. Okay. So what is sandpaper? Okay, what is the difference between scraper and sandpaper? Ang sandpaper po is used to smoothen the surface of wood. So meaning po, ang sandpaper gagamitin siya if yung wood hindi smooth. Okay? What is the difference between scraper and sandpaper? Ang scraper po ay magproduce na siya ng wood po. Magproduce na siya ng very smooth surface na wood po. Okay? Ang sandpaper gagamitin siya to smoothen the surface of the wood if hindi siya if hindi siya smooth. Okay? If hindi siya smooth. Okay. Next one po is Masilya. Okay, very good. Wow, very good naman. Masilya po, very good. Anong other term ng masilya, guys? Okay? Ang other term ng masilya is wood fillers. Okay, tama ka. Onyel 27 TV. <laughs> okay, wood fillers or masilya. Very good. So, it is used to eliminate deep cuts and holes. Okay, eliminate. Eliminate means to delete, okay, to get or to eliminate. Dapat wala nang deep cuts, wala nang holes. Gagamitin si Masilia, okay? That's it. Now, we have stain. What is stain? S T A I N. Okay? A wood finishing metal daw, okay, de derived from different color of wood such as walnut, mahog mahogany and natural color. Okay, that is stain po. Okay, yung different color. Okay, yung ang um, memorize nyo na lang is different color of wood. Okay, finishing metal po siya. A wood finishing metal. Okay, it is derived from different color of wood. Again, such as walnut, such, uh, such as mahogany and natural color na wood. Okay, and then may dalawang shellac po tayo. What is shellac? Okay, what is shellac, guys? Okay, shellac po came from the gum substances of insects. Okay, kung may insects, insects dyan. Okay, gum substances of insects. Okay, bubble gum. Okay, gum. Gum substances of insects. May dalawa po. Okay, orange shellac and white shellac. Okay, may dalawang color tayo. Orange and white. So, kapag sinabi mong orange, guys, siya po yung natural. Okay? Natural po siya na type. Okay? Hindi si white. <laughs> si white po yung bleaching. Okay? It is produced by bleaching. Mag-bleach ka. Okay? White shellac. And orange shellac is natural type. Alright. Amazing. Now, we have mm, we have uh, three types of paints. Okay? Ano? What is paint? Okay, paints. What is paints? It is most widely used in finishing a project, di ba? Pag may ginawa tayo, okay, maggagawa ka ng bookshelves. Okay, gumawa, gumawa kami ng bookshelves noon nung college and then nag, um, nilagyan namin ng paint. Okay, nilagyan namin ng paint. So, it is most widely used in finishing a project. It is like last na siya, like lagyan ng kulay ang mundo mo, Char. Okay? And then, may tatlo po tayong uli. Ori, okay? Ori, latex paint. We have enamel paint. And then, we have lacquer paint. Okay? Di ko alam kung paan babasa ito. Lacquer or lacquer. Okay? Latex paint, enamel paint, and lacquer paint. Okay, what is what are the differences? Okay, what is the difference between the three? Okay, pag sinabing latex paint, guys, okay, it is easier to work with and dries more quickly. So, madali po siyang madry si latex. So, it is easy to to use latex paint. Okay, so saan pa kayo? Sa latex na tayo. Char. Now, pag sinabi kong enamel, okay, enamel paint po, it is used for coating surfaces that are outdoors. So meaning, yung mga sa labas po na parts sa ating bahay, you can use enamel paint po kasi for outdoors siya. Pwede siyang maarawan, pwede siyang maulanan, hindi siya pwedeng saktan. Char. Okay, enamel paint used for coating surfaces that are outdoors. Alright. Okay, so now let's go to the next one. We have lacquer paint. What is lacquer paint? Right. 
Magsabi kong locker paint, guys. Uh, it is used for a number of hard and potentially shiny finishes applied to materials such as wood and metals. Okay, it is used for wood and metals. Okay, shiny finishes. Okay, yun lang pong mnemonic natin ngayon. Pag sabing locker paint, shiny finishes, wood and metals. Okay, hard. Hard and shiny finishes, wood and metals. Okay, pag sinabi kong easier to work, latex paint. Pag sinabi kong outdoors, enamel. And pag sinabi kong hard and shiny and wood and metals, lacquer paint. O siya, alright. <laughs> okay, enamel. Yes, mahirap daw matuyo yung enamel. Okay, sana all matuyo. <laughs> okay, so now let's talk about wood. Joints. Okay. Joints, joints naman tayo. Okay. Hindi po, hindi po ito science, kundi TLE po ito. Okay. Joints. Okay. Let's start with um, miter joint. Okay. I know. It's not miter. Meter joint. Okay. Or miter joint. M-I-T-E-R. Miter or meter joint. Okay. It uses a 45 degrees angle cut. Okay. So intended for make, making frames po. Okay? So, if meron kayong mga jowa-jowa dyan and gusto nyong bigyan ng frames, yung mga pictures nyo, okay? That is meter joint. Okay? Meter joint. <laughs> Alright. Now, how about rabbit joint? Mm, rabbit joint. Is it an animal? Mm, it, is, it is a joint. Okay? <laughs> rabbit joint is along the grain. Again, Along the grain po yung rabbit joint. Okay, anong difference? Okay, may difference po sila ni rabbit joint and dadu joint. Okay? Dadu joint and rabbit joint. Pag sinabi kong rabbit joint, guys, along the grain. Pag sinabi kong dadu joint, across the grain. Again, pag sinabi kong along the grain, rabbit joint. Pag sinabi kong across the grain, dadu joint po. Okay? That's it. Okay, so pag sabi kong rabbit joint, ano po yung usage na Ano po yung um, um, use, usage? Yes. Ano po yung usage ni rabbit joints? It, because rabbit joint is along the green because it is commonly used for making frames to hold glasses in drawers and other cabinet work. Okay, cabinet. Okay, rabbit. Okay, Gla glass holder po in drawers. Okay, that's it. How about dadu joint? Okay, alright. Si dadu joint po, used for making cabinets and bookshelves. Okay, it runs on board po si dadu joint. So, kas kasi across the green siya. So, commonly used for making cabinets and bookshelves. Dadu joints. Si rabbit joint, hold glasses and drawers, okay, and cabinet works. Alright, now... Let's go to mortise and tenon. What is mortise and tenon, guys? Okay, so actually, see si mortise and tenon. Mortise and tenon po is the oldest, okay? Oldest and strongest kind of food joint, okay? Very old, very strong. See si mortise and tenon, all right? So, this is considered best for quality chairs, tables and benches sa so mga sa mga upuan niyo diyan, sa mga tables niyo diyan, okay? Si mortis and tenon po ang ginagamit. Okay, mostly po because it is best po siya na gamitin po sa mga chairs, tables and benches. All right. Now, let's go to lap joint. Lap joint, L A P. Okay, ano yung lap joint guys okay lap joint po used for reinforcing wood length okay okay i-assemble po niya okay ang wood po wood assembling po is overlapping each other okay nag-overlap po yung pag-assemble ng wood okay pag sinabi kong lap joint okay reinforcing wood length so yung wood pag-assemble mo ng wood po nag-overlap po siya each other that is lap joint Naglap, lap, lap. <laughs> Hindi naglap, lap po. Overlap po. Overlap, lap, lap, lap joint. Okay? Yan po yung mnemonics natin dyan. Pag sinam kong bat, bat, bat. Bat joint. B-U-T-T. Okay? Hindi B-U-T-T-E-R-F-L-Y butterfly. Okay? Bat joint. Okay? It is the simplest type of food po. 
Okay? It is the simple. Simple lang siya. Okay? Alright? So, ang two pieces po na wood is nailed in one end. Okay? Na nailed po sila in one end. Ang two pieces of wood. So, very simple lang. Alright? Now, pag sabi yung dovetail, okay? Pag meron tayong butt, meron tayong tail. Okay? Dovetail joint. It is used on the corner, okay, on the corner of drawers and chairs. Okay, so makikita nyo sa mga corner sa mga corner sa drawers and chairs, makikita nyo si dovetail joint. Okay? Dovetail joint. All right. Again, dovetail joint used on the corner of drawers and chairs. Okay? So para po siyang magaganyan po. Ganyan. All right. Tenang. <laughs> All right. Now, pag sinabi kong tang tang and groove okay tang and groove tang po na spelling and groove is g r o o v e okay all right ano po ang tang and groove guys okay it allows guys it allows two flat pieces to be joined strongly together Okay, to make a single flat surface. So, dalawang flat pieces, i-join mo siya together para makamake ka ng single or one flat surface. That is tang and groove. Okay, tang and groove joint. Alright, so, ganyan po. May, may dalawa po na flat surface and then you, you will join it like like that. You will join it together para maka make ka ng isang flat surface. Okay? Alright. Ganyan pa. Now, again, pag sinabi kong picture frame, picture frame, anong joint iyan? Nakipakisagot. Okay? Pag sinabi kong picture frame, anong joint iyan? Alright. Hello, 129 viewers. Mm -mm -mm. Alright. Okay. Okay, hello again, Teacher Nikki. Okay, mahina ang signal ni Teacher Nikki. <laughs> Alright. So, very good po. Very good. That is meter joint. Wow, Melu Jane. Regular. Regular. <laughs> okay, meter joint po. Basta picture frame. Pag sinabi kong tables and chairs. Okay, tables and chairs lang. Okay, wala nang iba. Tables and chairs lang. That is lap or Bat joint. Okay, it's either of the two, lap or bat joint. Tables and chairs. If mag PRC, tables and chairs, and my choices doon, na, na, meron doon sa choices si lap, okay, you can answer lap. Pag wala si lap, and meron si lap, bat joint, okay, answer bat joint. Okay, pag sinabi kong tables, okay, tables, chairs, and benches, may benches na guys. Okay, pag sabi kong benches, may benches na, that is mortis and tenon. Again, chairs, table, and benches, mortis and tenon. Pag sinabi kong chairs and table lang, lap or bat joint. Pag sinabi kong picture frame, okay, meter joint. Wow, amazing. Alright, laban na ba? Papasa na ang 137 TLA majors natin ngayon. Okay, now, let's go to cutting tools. Okay, cut cut cut. Uh, ano ano mga ano ba ang mga cutting tools na makikita natin? Okay? All right. So we have first one, we have rip saw. Okay? R I P saw. Rip saw. Okay? Along the grain po ang pagcut po. Okay, gagamitin mo itong rip saw if ang pagcut mo is along the grain. Okay, along the grain. So, medyo malito kayo. Okay, we are now talking about cutting, guys. Okay, cutting-cutting na po tayo. So, sa mga joints-joints na pinag-usapan natin kanina, meron din across the grain and along the grain. Again, pag-usapan natin ulit. Pag sabi kong along the grain, okay, when we talk about common wood joints, along the grain is a rabbit joint. And kapag across the grain, that is dado joint. Okay, now, at, let's go to cutting. Okay, kapag nag-cut ka po along the grain, that is rip saw, R-I-P saw. Okay, rip saw. Alright. Kapag sinabi kong, um, uh, you will use this tool, guys, para sa irregular shape and curves. Okay, para maka-create ka ng irregular shape, maka-create ka ng curves. 
Okay, mga curves. Sorry for the pronunciation. Curves, okay? Coping saw. Alright. Ano po ito? Ano po ang coping saw? Okay, comment, comment. Okay. Makakreate po tayo ng curve shapes po. Okay, that is, that is, hmm, that is, was, coping so. Okay, coping so po. Very good. Coping so po, makakreate po tayo ng irregular shape and curves. Mga curves, curves po. Coping, again, co -co 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 coping, co -co -co curves. Again, co -co coping, co -co curves. Okay, that's it. Na, pag sabi kong, mag use use mo to ng tool na ito para mag-cut ka across the grain. Okay? Mag-cut ka across the grain. Okay? So, kapag sinabi kong along the grain, that is rip so. Pag sinabi kong across the grain, that is cross cut so. Okay? Cross cut so. Across, across the grain. Across, across cut so. Okay? Again, across the grain, across cut so. Cross cut so po ang sagot. Okay, alright. Now, ano po ang gagamitin natin pag gusto nating ikat yung metal? Mga metal-metal, okay. Yung hard na metal. Sinong gusto ang may... Kung sinong gusto, kung sinong gusto ng hard dito? Isip-isip. Char. <laughs> okay, to cut metal po. Okay, to cut metal is hakso. Okay, hakso. Alright, very good. Ang galing, galing, galing. Alright. Now, pag sinabi kong gagawin mo ito, okay, or i-use mo ito if you want to uh, create a circle shape in wood. Gusto, kang mag, gusto mong mag-create ng circle shape sa wood. Mm, ano ito? Alright. Gusto mong mag-create ng circle shape sa wood. Alright. Okay, sa, sa coping so guys, curves lang siya. Okay, curves. Pero sa dito, makakreate ka ng circle shape. Okay, ang gagamitin mo is keyhole or compass so. Wow, very good, Ma'am Angelica. That is compass so po. Okay, makakreate ka ng irregular and circle shape in the wood. Okay, keyhole or keyhole or compass so okay so i will pin i will pin it this one okay hope makita ng lahat ito keyhole or compass so all right now okay pag gagamitin mo to okay pag uh, gagamitin mo to pag my large large and round lumber Okay, large and round lumber po. Okay, anong so ang gagamitin mo? Okay, large and round lumber. Gagamitin mo ay, okay, ang gagamitin mo is long cross cut saw. Wow, very good. That's correct, long cross cut saw. Okay, alright. So, that's my concept for the TLE. Okay. So, I hope um, nakuha naman yung pagbagal-bagal ko. Ang bagal ko na. You can always go back. Okay, you can always go back sa aming video po. I-upload po namin after the live. Alright. So, comment naman if... If gusto niyong part 2. Char, part 2. Si, 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 si Teacher yeah, V na mag-part 2. Yan, nakuha na nila. <laughs> si Teacher V yung magpa-part 2. <laughs> yes, oh. i-upload po namin, sir. Ay, ma'am, Jam, 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 Mark, Jams. Yes, i-upload po. Yes. So, you can ask any questions po about the let. We can answer it if ma-answer po namin. All right. Okay, sa foods. So, my foods din. Okay. Actually, guys, okay. Tip, tip ko sa inyo. Tip ko sa inyo. Alright. Sa TLE po, um, marami po akong 
kaibigan na nag TLE major po. Okay, nag-take sa exam ng TLE and then sabi nila may ang lumabas po ay more on like calculating po. O magka-calcu ka, guys. Oh, yes, computation po. Okay, computation po. Yes, ma-upload po ito. Ma-upload po ito. At computation po yung sa TLE, meron din sa electricity, ganyan po. And then, ano pa ba? Yes. Plumbing. Yes, plumbing. All right. Pwede po ba yung complete concept ng TLE? <laughs> Grabe naman complete concept. Ang 12, 12 na area yung TLE, guys, right? 12 na area, tama ba ako? Maraming area. Ang dami area. po. Yes, very general, very broad po. So, laban lang. Okay, laban so, lang. So, electricity daw, electronics, business, math, and math. entrepreneurship. Okay. Ah, okay. Ayan. May tanong ako, guys. May tanong ako. So, sino dito ang nakatake na, okay, nakatake na ng ng exam at hindi pumalad yeah. sa exam. Okay, you can chat it here. You can chat sa comment po kung ano pong naglalabasan po na concepts during your time po. Alright? During your time. Yes, yeah, sino bang na, ano, nakatake na tapos hindi pinalad? Oh. Last June daw siya, 26, Christopher Chu. Oh, ako last June, 26, ah, Christopher okay. Chu. So, next week na yung ah. ano. Okay. So, sino ang mga next year taker dito? Okay, mga next year taker. So, mga, magtitik ng September, guys. Okay, More in so... foods po daw at situational. Mm-mm. Sabi ni Ma'am yes, Marie yes. Mar. Yes. Mm-mm. More in foods at po at situation. Okay, sino daw ang my GC dito na TLE Majorship? Pwede po ba magpa-add? Thank you so much and God bless. Bye. Bye, Reham na. Obpon. Okay. Mi September. Oh, maraming September dito. Alright. So, okay. Sa Gen Ed, guys. Okay, sa Gen Ed. Sa time mo, Teacher Nikki, ano po yung mas maraming lumabas? Sa Gen Ed? Ano? Ano concepts? Math at saka Filipino. Okay. Math at saka Filipino. So, ang PRC po ay nagpo-focus na po sila sa mga, mga, sa mga subjects po na essential or fundamental. Okay? Like mm-hmm. math. Filipino, science, and English. Yan po yung mga fundamental or mga essential po na subject. Dapat pagtuunan, pagtuunan, pagtuunan nyo ng pansin iyan. Okay? Plus, history po and Rizal. Laban lang. Okay? And Filipino as well. Yes. Okay? So, yes. So, dapat 100... bawat subject talaga. Study. Yes. Bawat subject. Ayan. All right. So, pasensya na po mga... kanina, masyado pong mabilis yung drills natin. So, ganun po kasi ako uh, sa sarili ko, nagdi-deal po ako ano, fast talaga sa sarili ko. Uh, yan yung technique ko kasi ano, para marami akong mabasa pa. Kasi maraming kailangang basahin, kaya yun yung technique ko, talagang binibilisan ko. Pero pwede rin nyo namang ulitin po mga katreyo yung video natin kasi i-upload naman po. So, pwede nyo po siyang i-post, tapos balik ulit, i-post, balik ulit. Ganun. Okay. So, yung, yung uh, purpose namin sa fast drills din po is para hindi po kayo uh, makapil ng antok. Ganun. Ayan. Para, para go lang lang go. ba diba? Ganun tayo eh. Ay, uh, yes. Laban lang, guys. Alright. So, sino pa bang may questions dyan? Okay, social major, social science major po next drill teachers. Okay, yung social Marami science. Marami daw cosmetology. Ah, oh, yes, cosmetology daw. Yes. And sa social science po, um sinabi ng kaibigan ko na may lumabas po, okay, bumalik po yung mga social science questions coming from from Gen Ed sa major po. 
Okay, so sa mga sa pag-answer mo ng Jan Ed guys, okay? So pag may nakita kang social science doon and then hindi mo alam ng sagot, search mo agad after sa Jan Ed na exam. Okay, kasi babalik daw 'yan sa major no, sa major niyo. Yes, tama 'yan. Okay, so gawa natin to ng ano? Okay. Alright. So ano po yung dapat gawin para effective ang pag-aaral? Ako po kasi preferred ko po maging, makinig sa drills at videos. Okay? Hello? Kasi pag nagbasa ako, <laughs> hindi ko Ako ba yung nano? Ako ba yung walang internet? Oh, yes, yes. Ay, narinig kita, narinig kita. Ah. Okay. Right. Okay na, okay na. Okay, okay, okay. Nag-freeze ka kanina. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> so, anong, ah, uh, okay. So, if gusto mong mag-drills, guys, okay, yung, ang tip ko po, okay, so kami pong tatlo ni Teacher Vian, Teacher Nikki, okay. Um, sa, sa, noong una po, okay, so Sir Melvin po ang pina, pinakinggan namin noong, noong una, Okay, so nakinig po kami ng mga mga drills ni Sir Melvin. Kaya kapag nag, nag, nagbabiyahe kami, sumasakay kami ng jeep, sa jeepney, hmm. if mag, mag-CCR kami or maliligo kami, okay, ipiplay po namin yan. So, while naliligo po, hindi po kami concentrate po sa pagligo. Like, ang concentration po namin sa pakikinig po sa mga drills. Okay, hmm. ni, Sir, ni Sir Melvin. Ganyan po. Alright, so... Ang gawin niyo, ang gawin niyo, okay? So please play it or you can download it or ay wag lang i-download kasi ang dami ng videos po. Okay, so just play it sa YouTube po and then always always practice din po. Okay, always practice. And then as well if may notes kayo diyan and gusto niyo talagang i-memorize yan or i-familiarize yan mga notes niyo, you can record yourself po. Okay, babasahin nyo, i-record nyo sa cellphone nyo. For example, sabihin nyo na, okay, types of chemical reaction, synthesis, combination, decomposition, substitution, okay, and then i-play nyo ulit, okay, sa, para making, mapakinggan nyo yung sarili nyo. Uh, yes. Yes, tama yan. Ikaw, teacher Nikki. Okay, so i-share na lang din natin. So sa time ko, yun lagi akong nagdi-drill every day. So since uh, may work din tayo uh, during that time. So ayan, so lahat ginagawa na natin. So pag may biyahe ako, yan nakikinig uh, bumabiyahe ako going to the work 13 minutes kasi yun. So ayun, nakikinig ako kay Sir Melvin. Pag nasa bahay na ako, tas mas marami akong time, nagbabasa talaga ako ng libro. Okay? Libro talaga. Yung mga concepts na hindi ko talaga, uh, hindi ako confident na kaya ko siyang sagutan. So, ganun po yung uh, technique ko. Tapos, dinidrill ko siya, yun, fast drills ako palagi sa sarili ko. Okay? Tapos, sinasabi ko talaga siya, para kang nagle-lecture sa sarili mo. ba? Diba? Kasi once kaya mo siyang sabihin, i-drill sa sarili mo, meaning, naiintindihan mo talaga yung concept. Pag hindi mo siya kayang i-explain sa sarili mo, ayan, o hindi mo siya kayang i-drill ng yung pangbangbilisan meaning talaga ano hindi mo talaga siya nakukuha kaya, kaya drill lang drill uh, always drill drill lang talaga repetition lang talaga yung kailangan okay tapos pag prof ed naman yun kailangan mong pag-aralan lahat ng concepts okay wala kang dapat um i ano i miss na concepts kasi lahat sila importante tsaka mapa, mahilig mag-surprise si si PRC kasi yung mga ano gumagawa ng exam natin okay so ayun so marami silang ano uh, pa surpresa kaya kailangan handa ka always no Ganun yes yun. yes Mm-mm. and then additional so my question po any tips po for shading yung back page po ba ng test paper na erase nyo po yes po okay ganito po ang pag erase po ng back page okay let's have an example char so na all my example okay so for example ito po yung paper nyo and then nag-shade kayo okay nag-shade kayo guys okay and makita nyo sa likod po okay may nakita kayo sa likod ito po hindi po makita meron po siyang blot Okay, ito po. Uh, ganyan po. Yan po. Meron po siyang bulge sa likod. And then, actually, that bulge, guys, uh, meron po siyang mga black-black. Like, meron po siyang mga something na parang 
lapis din. Okay? Pag nag-shade ka sa, sa harapan, parang nashadean mo din yung likod. So, dapat, ang gagawin mo, kuha ka ng eraser. Okay, eraser. At dapat, smoothly lang yung pag, pag-erase mo sa likod. Okay? To flatten the bulge. Para hindi na po siya magbubulge. Okay, dapat ma-flatten siya yung likod. Alright? So, huwag niyo pong gamitin sa pag-erase yung lapis po. Okay? Yung yung red color na nasa mongol to nyo na eraser, wag niyo po yung gamitin. Kunin niyo po iyan or kainin niyo, char. Wag niyo wag niyo kainin. <laughs> okay, kunin niyo po at okay. bumili po kayo ng <laughs> bumili po kayo ng mga like eraser po na na legit. Okay? Yung may black color, yung ginamit ko yung black color na eraser for exam talaga. Para sa exam talaga. Okay, yan po. Okay, wag kayong magdala ng Mongol 2 na eraser. Okay, wag yung gamitin yan kasi if ginamit nyo yan, yung eraser sa pencil nyo, mag-red yung scantron nyo. Okay, hindi hindi na yan mababasa ng machine. Okay, yan po. Alright. Okay, so, by the way, okay, so, condolence po sa family. Okay, rest in peace po. President, former President Fidel V. Ramos. Oh. Condolence po sa pamilya to our former President Fidel V. Ramos. Okay. Ah, yes. All right. So I think um, okay na to. Uh, I think okay na tayo sa drills and then itas nagbigay din tayo ng tips. So wag po kayong mag-alala. We will uh, give po um, Uh, and I'll give separate video but uh, teacher echo para sa ating tips. Yes. Guys, actually guys, okay mag-alala. Yes, kasi mag live po kami. Okay, i-download din po namin. Okay, I- exclusively lang po sa mga pamahiin, sa mga belief, sa mga gawin bago or during the exam or after the exam din. Okay? So we will do our hmm. best po. Marami tayong i-share. Okay, marami po tayong mga isi-share about mga pamahiin, about mga anong gagawin talaga sa exam. And ano po yung mga dapat kainin mo and ano ang dapat in- inumin mo para hindi kayo magtul- magtutulog-tulugan sa exam. Okay? Alright. Okay. Yes. Okay. So, Okay na po ba tayo diyan? Comment hearts naman if if okay if okay tayo diyan. If okay na tayo yes. sa ating live today. So thank you so much for watching 130 plus. Thank viewers. you for staying with us mga katreyo. Ayan. So tawagin natin si Teacher B. Siya yung magpa-part 2. <laughs> yes, mo part si Teacher B. <laughs> Okay, so don't forget yes. to to like our page, guys. I have a page, Teacher Echo. You can always search that on FB page, on uh, Facebook. Okay, and Teacher Nikki? Yes, my FB page po is Teacher Nikki Loret. Ayan. Okay. So doon po kami nag-update sa aming mga private group. At aming private group, ang aming ano, sa mga live po namin sa YouTube. Okay, so if you are a first timer here watching our live today, don't please um, click subscribe and click the notification bell if gusto niyo pa ng aming mga videos, Char. All right. Yes. Okay. All right. Gusto niyang all right ko. <laughs> all right. So thank gusto you, everyone. All right, and... Yes. Pang DJ da tayo dito. Thank you. Oh, thank you so much, everyone, and have a great day. Okay, so wag na kayo magpa-stress. Study na kayo jan. Okay, laban lang. Yes. Okay. Good night, everyone. Good luck. Bye bye. Thank you.